Hi, this is Shannon of Seraphim's Keep and this is our November Insight. I want to thank all of you that came down to the Mystic Fair um, at the Empire uh, Concord and I'm going to be doing the Boo and Brew Fest tonight if uh, anybody's opening this on Friday. Maybe I'll see you there. Um, I wanted to tell you the events at the Keep really quickly because we've got a lot of events uh, in November. As you know, I've started the Meetup group which is a free group that you can sign up and learn about the events as they're being posted and also get the group rates. Um, this week we're going to have Adam um, Bernstein there, the medium. Uh, it's a great time of year to uh, speak with those that have passed over, let them know you still think about them, make the connection, um, get closure. So Adam will be doing private readings this week. Uh, also Kerry Kanan who does the EFT which is emotional freedom technique. It's a tapping technique that you tap and you say affirmations and it helps you reprogram yourself. Um, she's doing a series of talks called Get Your Sexy Back. And the focus is to run it over winter so when spring and summer comes, you're going to be feeling better about your body, feeling better about yourself. Um, so it's going to address weight, it's going to address um, insecurities. So that will be a great uh, two-hour workshop. I'm going to be teaching a class on how to read the tarot using your intuition. Uh, that also starts in a week. We're going to have our drumming circle with Connie Caldez on the 14th. Um, that teaches you how to meditate to the beat of a drum and, and meet your power animal. We also have a new person coming to the keep called Bettina Zomdik, and she is going to be teaching you um, healthy ways to eat over the holidays. She's a master chef and nutritionist for a macrobiotic diet, which is a diet which is uh, based on eating in harmony with the universe. So she's going to be teaching really easy substitutions and remedies um, so the holiday eating habits don't weigh you down in more ways than one. So here we go for the insight for November. So the November, as you know, I pull the Words to the Wise Oracle cards, which is my deck. Also, gift certificates are available at this time of year. Actually, they're always available, but especially this time of year. So the card on the physical plane is Chaco Canyon. And Chaco Canyon talks about being overwhelmed. It's about a lot of energy coming. If you've ever been to Chaco Canyon, it's a very powerful place in New Mexico, but there's a lot of energy coming at you to where it can be confusing or overwhelming. And the spiritual plane of November was pure intellect, which is about getting an idea that can define who you are. But when I put these cards together, what it tells me is that November is not going to be the month for uh, playing it by ear or winging it. November is the month to go with the tried and true. Um, it's going to be a very chaotic energy. There's a lot coming at you, which you probably already know. It's the holidays. But um, trying to take that new route somewhere may not work out. You know, trying to do that special recipe you've never done before may not be such a great idea. Um, if you're one that can handle stress and are okay to be half an hour late, you know, it's not such a big deal. Or, you know, if you try that meal and it doesn't work out and you're okay to improvise, that might be okay too. But if you are someone that feels the pressure of the holidays, this is not the month to try something new. Um, if you have to try something new, if you've already committed to it, I would make sure you have a side person working with you to just help you stay on track uh, because anything that can go wrong will go wrong in November on these certain days. It's not the whole month, but just on the days that count, um, there's going to be so much going on and so much focus of energy that uh, it'll be really hard to really ground something that you haven't tried before. So have a wonderful November, have a wonderful Thanksgiving. Um, this is like the day before uh, Halloween, so if you're seeing this before Halloween, have a great Halloween. And I look forward to seeing you in December. Thanks so much.